the hiking chair by Staples. Yo, what up, YouTube? It's your boy Richard. You guys can call me Richie. This is the channel, Gaming Life channel, home of the gamers. If you guys are here right now, it's because you stumbled onto my video. This video is about assembling the hiking chair by Staples. Uh, stay tuned if you guys want to see how to assemble these chairs and see what the chairs looks like. I'm going to give you guys a, a quick description and my first impression of, of what I think about the chair. And there's going to be a review coming up. Um, if you guys want to see the unboxing of the chair, there's going to be a link in the description. Don't forget to uh, subscribe to the channel, click that little bell, click the thumbs up, click the thumbs down. Whichever one you want, you can also uh, leave a comment, interact with the page. Leave a comment in the comment section, and uh, let's make this happen. Catch you guys in a bit, y'all. The Hiking Chair by Steve. Hey gang, one of the biggest reasons why I bought this chair, actually not one of the biggest, but the biggest reason why I bought this chair was due to the fact that it was cost efficient, okay? That's the reason why I didn't buy a Herman Miller, a Secret Lab, or any other chair that's considered high quality. But do keep this in consideration. A cheaper chair also means a lower quality product. And that's your trade-off. I also bought a protection plan for the chair. For some of you that want to know more about the protection plan, I'll be going more in depth about it near the end of the video, so stay tuned if you're interested in that. I also want to give you guys a teaser on some of the videos, the upcoming videos that we're going to be making. Um, so the protection plan, I'll be testing it, and the reason for that is I had some complications with my chair and I accidentally broke it while assembling it. So I will be making a review on the protection plan as well. Enjoy the rest of the video, I'll catch you guys in a few minutes.
For some of you who want to know the price of uh, the chair when I bought it, uh, so it was bought in 2021, okay, uh, December 2021, in Canada as well. I think it's uh, it's worth me mentioning that I did buy the chair in Canada. Okay, so it's Canadian money at a Canadian store as well. So I bought the chair for $2.99 before taxes. And I also bought a plan, a protection plan for the chair if the chair breaks. So that plan was about $20. So with tax and everything, it came up to um, 361 and an odd change. Okay, so listen up, like I said, there's a protection plan as well that goes with uh, the chair that I bought. And I think uh, it might be a good thing to get the protection plan. Um, the reason I'm saying is because the salesman actually gave me very good information on the protection plan. It's If, if it's all true, it's a really good plan to have. Um, unfortunately, while I was building the chair, um, I dropped the chair from the table. The table actually, actually the, the chair just slid off the table and then it broke. There, there's a piece of plastic that broke. Okay, so one of the things about these chairs is, uh, yes, okay, it comes at a good price, but it's not hard metal. It's not really quality or anything like that. So it does break easily. And uh, I'm first hand experience. Hey, listen, I was building the chair on the table. The thing fell, I got it all on footage. I'll, I'll be making a video of that as well so you guys can see. So the chair fell off the table and it broke, okay? That's how cheap it is. Hey, it's a table. It's about what, like two feet and a half, three feet tall, something like that, and it broke. That's how cheap the chair is, okay? Is it comfy to a certain degree it is? I mean, look, it's not a $1,000 uh, Herman Miller chair, okay? So keep that in mind as well. Um, for, for like, I wanna come back in depth about the chair. Like, I wanna make a review about the chair when the time comes, okay? I wanna talk to you guys about why I find it all right and why I find it not comfortable. I guess it all depends on, on, on your height and stuff like that, okay? So I'll get in depth into another video down the line within like a month or two or something, okay? So I do want you guys to stay tuned. Um, uh, sometime this week, I'll be calling uh, the protection plan, the people that work, that work over there. I'll call them up and I'll see how this whole procedure, how it works. And uh, I'll let you guys know a review on the service. Uh, if they actually kept their word, if it's worth it, if it's not worth it. But I mean, from what the salesman was saying, it's actually a good idea to get the plan. So, and unfortunately I broke the chair. And fortunately I got the plan. Might as well try it, you know what I mean? So stay tuned for that. Um, it was a budget chair, one of the best budget chairs out there, if you ask me. If anybody else knows any chair that competes with this for the price and the quality, let me know in the comments. I'll check them out, I might buy more chairs, I'll do more videos, we'll see what comes up in the near future. Um, I think that's it for now, uh, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, I'll catch you guys on the flip side, peace.